Hi viewers, welcome to all. Here we are discuss about a project image demo striking using super resolution technique. Okay, in this research, a super resolution demo striking technique is developed with the goal of reconstructing an enhanced resolution full color images from the sample way of uh, both resilient and does not need a training procedure to design the fully pipeline the super resolution color demo clicking technique using bicubic interpolation to increase the PSNR and SSIM. The proposed work of this design, uh, the super resolution demo clicking hardware machine using carry skip adder and prove the performance with the existing conventional uh, full adders and uh, execute this work in Xilinx FPGA okay with support of VHDL and compared all the parameters in terms of area delay and power okay so this is a paper uh, so here we have used uh, the demo skaking with a super resolution technique for super resolution we have used as a bicubic interpolation and uh, the existing method is the image demo skaking okay so here this demo skaking paper we have taken from here the fully pipeline low cost and high quality color demo skaking VLSA design designed for real time video applications okay as per this paper of color filter we have developed the code uh, using the resolution of 256 cross 256 input okay so this is a color filter array input uh, it will be covered up in the figure 2 the block diagram of proposed color demo skaking algorithms okay so input pixels they are given CFA okay and it will be come with the boundary detector boundary mirror machines okay so after that they are directed this uh, in green color interpolations with the mirror pixels and red blue color interpolations as per this block diagram they have developed the architectures here in the figure 3 okay block diagram of VLSA architectures for the proposed color demo skipping, uh, design okay so this is a overall uh, structure uh, here they will mention the hardware sharing machine 1 hardware sharing machine 2 and register bank hardware sharing machine 3 so all the machines they are given okay so as per the CFA pixel input uh, uh, we have desired uh, it's a mirror machines or boundary uh, director the selections point will be covered up with here okay so this is a position for inj and this is a signal for output okay so it will be sampled output given to the controller okay so as per this uh, block diagram uh, the hardware sharing machine one two three architectures given here okay so here this is an interpolation technique for green and red blue okay and this is an interpolation technique for green red and blue okay first we need to uh, take an input image and it will be converted to the hexadecimal file after that the hexadecimal file uh, given to the memory module then the memory module file we are reading and after that uh, it will be given as an input to this hardware machines okay so here as per the input uh, images that means 0, 0, 0, 0,0, 0, 0,1, 0, 0,2 uh, we are uh, splitted and it will be given as an input here okay so here you can check the uh, values a b c d e f g h okay uh, so based upon this uh, we have splitted the images and we are taken uh, the output okay so here you can check all the architectures architecture of the hardware sharing m3 okay so once we have completed this paper the color demo striking cfa uh, after that we are taken as a uh, bicubic interpolations okay so for reference we have used this paper the real time FPGA based architecture for bicubic interpolations okay so for this bicubic interpolations we are given uh, the input pixel is 256 cross 256 and we are taken output pixel is 512 cross 512 okay so here uh, we have interpolations with the horizontal and vertical uh, bypassing stages also after that we are taken as a final output okay so this is a uh, hardware architecture for bicubic interpolations okay so here uh, initially we need to load the data into the input buffer so this is a horizontal process and this is a vertical process so once the interpolation technique completed we will take an as a output from the output buffer okay so we will explain all the things in the RTL schematic okay so here this is a top model uh, paper okay so image demo skaking using super resolution technique okay so this paper they are focused for the color demo skaking technique uh, 
uh, using the bicubic interpolation to increase the resolutions of the images uh, with support of super resolution technique okay so now we can verify the VHDL coding okay so here so this is the existing method okay so here we have designed a two different architectures one is uh, for demo scaping method using conventional uh, full adder another one is a demo, demo scaping method using uh, carry skip adder so here you can check initially we have designed uh, this code in VHDL okay so this is a clock and reset okay so here we are using number of file reading and number of file writing code so that file reading uh, it will read the data from the input image okay and it will be uh, stored into the memory model okay so once the memory model completed it will given to the top model of architecture so this is the top model of the srd super resolution 256 plus 256 okay so this r data channel and r uh, data c channel b channel this is the input and this is the address okay so this initial input we are given into uh, the srd controller okay so this srd controller will read the data and the data will given into the demo stacking memory mode okay so this demo stacking architectures will have a memory okay so initially cover up with the uh, memory model okay so here this is the input memory this is the output memory and control buffer register bank 1 register bank 2 boundary director boundary mirror machine hardware sharing 1 hardware sharing 2 hardware sharing 3 ha control unit okay so all the uh, things cover up to here as per the base paper so once uh, we have completed the demo stacking output we are taken here okay and it will be stored into the interpolation memory okay so this interpolation memory will have a uh, three different models one is for rgb okay so once it will be completed uh, we are given the data into the bicubic interpolations okay this is a bicubic interpolation model so this bicubic interpolation r channel uh, will cover up with uh, uh, so this is a model so the interpolation memory will read the data and it will be given to the bicubic accumulate uh, uh, or channel horizontal interpolation vertical interpolation and finally data load into the memory okay so once this bicubic interpolation model completed uh, we are taken the data again using the file writing code here okay and finally we are come up with the final output okay so this is a simulation process for this model okay so this is a test bench okay so this is the initial uh, data loading okay wow. and uh, this is a super resolution 256 plus 256 okay so here this is the initial method uh, to load the data okay and after that uh, this done is rd uh, came okay so this is a process for horizontal and vertical interpolations with bicubic interpolation architecture okay so here you can check the srd controller uh, demo stacking 256 plus 256 okay okay and this is the interpolation memory okay so once demo stacking completed uh, the interpolation memory will read the data okay so after that it will be given into the bicubic uh, r channel g channel and b channel you can uh, check the time period for all the things okay demo stacking and this time for interpolation memory and this time for bicubic interpolation okay okay horizontal interpolation okay and this is a vertical interpolation okay finally come up with the file writing okay so after this simulation we have two output images okay so this is a one of the output images so input is 256 plus 256 resolution output is 512 plus resolution and you can check the psnr value 38.67 so in the paper already they are given some psnr value we can compare with the paper okay so here this is a uh, lena okay here you can check the psnr value around it will be take 25.8 dp okay and uh, this is 27.1 uh, dp
db 27.2 db 25.3 db okay so as per the output they have proved some images okay so here we have taken uh, 38.6767 uh, is a and the ssim is 0 0.9 okay and uh, here this is uh, another uh, input and output images so the left images is an input uh, for 256 plus 256 input resolution and right side images is 512 plus 512 okay so after this simulation process completed uh, and we can check the synthesis output okay here this is the existing method okay and this is a proposed method okay so here you can check the uh, post synthesis and post implementation with the table okay you can check the values okay and you can check the power dynamic and static power and uh, here you can check the RTL schematic okay so here this is the RTL schematic so initially we have loaded the data into the uh, SRD controller the SRD controller will given the data into demo sketching technique okay so this is a demo sketching for 256 plus 256 so this is a demo sketching architecture it will come up with the two memory buffer so here this is a memory buffer control unit a control buffer a, and register bank one a, boundary detector a, boundary mirror machine a, hardware sharing one a, two a, uh, register bank a, okay so output memory buffer hardware sharing three so this hardware sharing input part we have designed with the carry skip adder okay so this is a carry skip adder so it will have uh, this type of architectures okay so each carry skip adder have uh, ripple carry adder with the multiplexer okay so okay so after this demo stacking uh, we are given the data into the interpolation memory okay so the interpolation memory will read the data and it will be stored the data into the three different memories one is for or G B okay hard memory G memory B memory uh, this memory process completed after that it will given the data into the by cubic interpolation okay so R channel for R by cubic interpolation G channel for G by cubic interpolation and B channel for B by cubic interpolation okay so we are doing this by cubic interpolation separate separately and finally we are taken as a separate separate uh, hex file output okay so this by cubic interpolations will have uh, image by cubic uh, R channel and uh, horizontal interpolations R channel and uh, vertical interpolations okay and this is a block memory 512 cross 512 this is the final output we are taken uh, from this memory and uh, okay so this is the overall RTL schematic okay and uh, this comparisons we have updated the comparisons document here so here you can check the conventional ripple carry adder existing and carry skip adder is a proposed okay so this is a comparisons chart okay and uh, we are written an abstract document for this project here you can check it okay so here base paper abstract improvement of the project proposed title proposed abstract okay and uh, existing system review of super resolutions okay so related notes the disadvantages proposed systems implementation okay so everything uh, we are given here for students reference verifications okay so here you can check all the things okay so finally it touches away and references okay thank you bye if you need more video related to vlsi project please like and subscribe this channel